Hey everybody, what's up? Um, wow, thank God it's Friday. Um, had a lot of activity on my channel this week, thanks to my sandwich video. Uh, and I had a lot of puzzled people as to what the deal with that was. Um, one of the things I put that up there for was to do a test on what it takes to make a video on YouTube that gets views. And to my dismay, I found out that all it takes is a 30 second video with no editing of me eating a sandwich to get over a thousand views <laughs> in less than 24 hours. Um, it was fun to do kind of as an art uh, Andy Warhol type thing and I may do more of it um, it was interesting to see people jump on it um, but for my longer vlogs for my you know I had a video last weekend that took me four hours to edit that gets you know a quarter of the views in four times as many days makes me makes me look at YouTube a little differently or it makes me look at what I want from YouTube a little bit differently I guess is the way to put it because I know that I could do things to get more views like that all the time um, but there was something else behind behind the sandwich if you will you know not behind the music but behind the sandwich the whole and then it all fell apart part of the behind the music thing kinda hit me this week um, on Monday at my place of employment eight people were escorted out the door we were right sized as they called it um, I've been with the company 14 years <sighs> Some of the people that left were there as long as I've been. Um, we don't have that big of a building. We had 30-something, so we lost a, almost a third of our staff. We lost three or four other people in some various other locations. We, we've got a couple offices in my building, or in my company. And... I know I shouldn't even be talking about work on here. I know this is the type of thing that can get you in, in deep trouble. So I won't go into the specifics of it or make any broad accusations or statements about it. Other than we were told time and time again it was financial. It was purely a numbers thing. And to see these co-workers being escorted out, to wonder if this was happening to me next, was a horrible day. Uh, I came home Monday night, catatonic, basically, and we were given no excuse until Tuesday. And obviously the excuse is something we're all quite angry about. Um, and it's been a rough ass week because of it. When people with a little more time than you that seem just as important, who work just as hard, when they're left go for financial reasons nothing personal well these people were my friends so it is personal so I came home Monday night Tuesday night very catatonic and I've had two or three friends from this site who I've chatted with in depth about this on the phone via email or via chat and you guys carried me through this um, 
this has brought up a lot of questions for me. It's taught, it's showed me what I need to do, what I need to do to prepare myself. Um, but it was not a good week. <laughs> so there comes, you know, or insert the sandwich video. And what was the deal with the sandwich video? Tuesday night, it was too raw to talk about. Wednesday night we had a, or Wednesday we had a counseling thing, and Wednesday night I told my family about it, and just talking about it brings up all these emotions again, all this anger again. So Tuesday night, to escape, to avoid, what we learned in our counseling, avoidance. To avoid it, I did the sandwich video. And other people made sandwich videos, and the comments in these these comment threads got pretty raunchy at times. Um, and I literally was laughing out loud, and I was in tears. Laughing tears. And I was able to avoid and just ignore this crappy situation. And I was able to calm down and at least fall asleep. Now, every time I wake up, I, I still think about this. I think about these people that were let go. Um, think about my friends. I think about what this means to my career, to my coworkers' career, all this stuff. But this video sharing site that they say the community is dead on this site whether you guys knew it or not you were helping me through this you were helping me divert my attention and sometimes isn't that what friends are all about even if they don't know it so yes, the sandwich video was twofold here. It was about making an avant-garde piece of Andy Warholian art. Three, threefold, probably, was the art. It was fourfold, because it was the art. It was about actually eating a sandwich. Um, it was the little experiment to see just how lame I could make a video. <laughs> and, and the amount of response I could get to it and the honors I got. And four, it was just to avoid what was going on. And for that, I thank all of you. Um, and I hope none of you ever have to go through this. So uh, it's all I really want feel comfortable talking about. Well, I'm probably saying too much the way it is, but I don't really care. <laughs> so... Thanks for listening. Thank God it's Friday. Uh, I think I can actually put this aside. I have some work to do to prepare myself um, for the future. But I'm going to just have a good weekend, relax, and try to go on with things. So that's all for now. I'll talk to you guys later. Take it easy. Thanks a lot. Bye.